sure will have it. Yes. Right there. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? back at it again with my good friend Amber. Today we are at the beautiful Hotel Murano in downtown Tacoma and we're doing like a sponsored editorial commercial shoot, right? Yeah, that's fair. That's okay, fair. Cool. Just kind of uh, like a day in the life. Sweet. I'll let Amber, you know, tell us what's going on because really, you guys, I never know what's going on. I just show up and do my thing. Okay, but I am doing behind the scenes on the Osmo Pocket. I'll be shooting with the Z6. So I will take you guys along the ride. But um, Amber, why don't you tell them what we are actually shooting or what, what's going on? All sure. Right. So the first one here, uh, it's more like getting ready to start my day. I woke up like this clearly. Um, and then we'll transition to some more like casual uh, throughout the hotel and then more in the evening, how we transition to like dinner. So it's gonna be fun. You know, a lot going on throughout the day. But we're gonna start here in the room um, and they've graciously provided us a corner room with a king size bed. It's beautiful in here. So we hope to capture as much content in this room as possible. Sweet. So, uh, with that being said, uh, let's just cut to the chase. Let's no more talk or talk. Let's just get straight to the shoot. And uh, yeah, let's go. Okay, so before we get into things, I want to take a second to give a shout out to Skillshare. That's right, Skillshare, the online learning community for creatives with more than 25,000 classes uh, based in design, business, Photoshop. If you want to learn to be a better photographer, make better YouTube videos, get your Instagram popping, you name it, they probably got it. Skillshare is super affordable with an annual subscription less than $10 a month. A premium membership gives you unlimited access so you can join classes and communities that are just right for you and your New Year's goals. My personal goal has been to get better at retouching and color grading, so I've been taking advantage of the communities and the classes that are centered around retouching and color grading in Photoshop to be specific. So, join more than 7 million creators learning with Skillshare. And if you're one of the first 500 of my subscribers to use the link in the description, you'll get a two-month free trial. So whether you want to fuel your curiosity, creativity, or even career, Skillshare is the perfect place for you to keep learning and thriving in 2019. So again, make sure you're one of my first 500 subscribers to hit the link in the description so you can get that two-month free trial. Alright, now let's back to the show. Okay, so YouTube, uh, first look is the, you, you said you're waking up for today? I'm waking up for today. Okay, so this is a waking up for today look. Uh, we have her on this bed. Now, what's going on here is we have the sun right here, and there's not a lot of good natural light coming in, but it's not enough. Oh, flip the camera around. Uh, <laughs> it's not enough for her, like, to get real feel light. When you're in situations like this, I brought my, my flash. I have my, um, what is this thing called? Glow have my Glow 34 inch beauty dish soft box with my Godox uh, 8360 slash uh, Flashpoint uh, 360. And what's going on is I'm using that to light her face to bring in more fill light. When I took a picture without the light, um, this part was this part was exposed fine, but her face was very much in shade. So I used the light to kind of balance out to kind of bring the light on the top half of the photo. I'm gonna show you guys a picture of what it looks like so you can see what's going on. Okay, on the left we have the natural light photo. On the right we have the one with the fill flash added in. Now, again, um, the one on the left, even though it's natural light, it's a bit light at the bottom, you always want the brighter part of the image um, to be the one where you want the attention to be drawn to. So, in that case, I noticed that like the bottom was brighter than the top and I could have used in Lightroom I could have like brightened up her face or that upper area like dodge and burn and I could have edited it to make it look right but I figured if I have a flash if I can get it right done right in camera then that's less work I have to do in post so the whole point of me using the flash to brighten up the top part of her face was to just make my job easier in post so I don't have to go through and photoshop and brighten up like 50 or 100 or 20 different photos of the top it's just evenly lit it looks natural still it doesn't look super flashy or super dramatic it looks like a natural scene it's just been lit with flash at the top to even out the um, image so yeah anyways on to the show
Um, sit both legs on the bed. Oh, yeah, and then like maybe you're reading a magazine or something. Mm. Yeah, like a mag a magazine. She's reading a magazine <laughs> and she's getting ready. Oh wait, how about a magazine? I got a date. I got a plan. Okay, all right, cool. <laughs> Like when you wake up in the morning, like what would you? Right, I would do that. What's your exact morning routine? Like what would you be doing? Like maybe you'd be like looking at social media or something like that, like on your phone. True. Sure. Like, I don't know. Like Good idea would be to, uh, maybe like a look of you like coming down like you're coming out like you're walking out this way hold that hold that right there hold that actually come to the yeah, yeah relax the face a little bit yeah yeah perfect and then like face this way towards the light yeah perfect hold that don't move come up a little bit closer right there perfect hold that do not move and then and it look like you like walking out like oh Perfect, yep. <laughs> yeah. yeah, actually, that's lovely. Stay there, hold that. Okay, YouTube, so what's going on here is we are doing a third look. This is a night out on the town look or whatever, but you're like in the, ho in the hotel, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. So this is a night out on the town. We're in the hotel, so I'm going to use lighting to force some light, light my subject, because there is no real good ambient light here, so I want to make sure that she's lit. She's the center of attention for the shot. So I have my 25 inch uh, beauty dish, the Glow Easy Lock Beauty Dish with the grid because I want the light focused. I don't want the light spilling everywhere. So I want the light focused on her. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna set up the shop and you guys just, you know, enjoy the show. All right, cool. <laughs> Good track.
that's gold. 